Have you ever wondered if the physical shifts you experience could be messages from your twin flame, your soul's mirror? This concept might seem a bit out there, but let's take a second to explore. Twin flames, as they are known, represent a unique spiritual connection that goes beyond the physical realm. It's like having a mirror to your soul, reflecting your deepest emotions, thoughts, and experiences. Now imagine a form of communication that transcends traditional means. It's not about words, written or spoken. It's something more profound, more intimate. It's about body changes, subtle shifts that carry messages from your twin flame. This might sound like a page from a science fiction novel, but for many, it's a profound reality. So, are you ready to discover a different realm of communication? A realm that connects you to your twin flame in ways you've never imagined? Let's delve into the fascinating ways your twin flame could be communicating with you through your body changes. Before we explore these body changes, let's first understand who or what a twin flame is. It's a term you may have come across in spiritual or metaphysical discussions, but what does it really mean? A twin flame, in essence, is a mirror of your soul. It's not about romance or physical attraction, but rather an intense, profound connection that transcends the physical realm. This is a bond that is formed on a higher plane of existence, a connection that is spiritual and cosmic. In the grand tapestry of the universe, every soul is believed to split into two upon entering a physical form. These two halves journey through different paths, gathering unique experiences and lessons. A twin flame is the other half of your soul, your spiritual counterpart. When you meet your twin flame, it's like looking into a mirror that reflects not just your physical self, but your soul's essence, your fears, your desires, your strengths, and your weaknesses. Now, how does a twin flame differ from a soulmate? It's a common question. While a soulmate is indeed a deep spiritual connection, it is fundamentally different from a twin flame. Soulmates are kindred spirits. They resonate on the same frequency, and their relationship is often harmonious. On the other hand, a twin flame union is characterized by its intensity. It's not always harmonious. In fact, it can be chaotic and challenging, pushing you towards spiritual growth and transformation. It's about evolution and ascension, about confronting your deepest fears and overcoming them. But remember, the journey to finding your twin flame isn't about seeking completion in another. It is about recognizing the divine within you, embracing your individuality, and growing spiritually. Only then, when you are in complete harmony with your own soul, can you truly connect with your twin flame. Now that we've established what a twin flame is, let's explore the first way they communicate through body changes. The first way twin flames communicate through body changes is through sudden shifts in energy. Now let's delve into this fascinating phenomenon. Imagine yourself going about your day, everything is normal, then all of a sudden, you feel an intense surge of energy. You're not sure where it came from, but it's powerful, almost overwhelming. Conversely, you might find yourself feeling inexplicably drained, a sudden fatigue washing over you like a wave. These are not random occurrences, my friends. They are, in fact, one of the ways twin flames communicate. When twin flames connect, their energy fields intertwine. This connection is so deep and so profound that it can affect your physical body. You might feel an unexpected burst of energy, as if you've been supercharged. This could be your twin flame sharing their vibrancy, their zest for life with you. It's as if they are saying, I'm here, I'm vibrant, feel my energy. On the other hand, you might experience a sudden drop in your energy levels, a sense of fatigue that seems to come out of nowhere. This could be your twin flame communicating their exhaustion, their need for rest and rejuvenation. It's as if they're whispering, I'm tired, I need to recharge, bear with me. These energy shifts are not something to be alarmed about. In fact, they are a testament to the deep bond you share with your twin flame. When you experience these shifts, take a moment to acknowledge them. Understand that they're not random, but messages from your twin flame. It's important to remember that these energy shifts are not just about sharing feelings. They are a form of communication, a way for twin flames to express their needs, their desires, their emotions. So next time you feel an unexpected surge of energy or an unexplained wave of fatigue, don't dismiss it. 
It could be your twin flame trying to communicate something important. So next time you experience a sudden energy shift, it could be your twin flame trying to communicate something important. Physical ailments are another way your twin flame might be communicating with you. Yes, you heard that right. As uncanny as it may sound, those inexplicable aches or sudden bouts of fatigue may not be as random as you think. In the realm of spiritual connections, the body becomes a vessel for communicating messages from your twin flame. Imagine you're experiencing a sudden onset of headaches. You've had your eyes checked, you're drinking plenty of water, and your stress levels are under control. Yet, the headaches persist. Could it be that your twin flame is experiencing emotional turmoil or intense stress? It's very likely. Your bodies are tuned into each other, acting as mirrors, reflecting each other's physical state. Now, let's take another scenario. You're waking up in the middle of the night with a strange feeling in your chest like your heart is fluttering. It's not a physical condition and it's not anxiety. It's an unusual sensation that you can't quite place. This could be your twin flame experiencing strong emotions of love, longing, or perhaps even sadness. Physical discomforts also tend to manifest more intensely during significant events. Let's say you're going through a major life change, a new job, a move to a new city, or even the end of a relationship. During these times, your twin flame could be communicating their support or empathy through shared physical sensations. However, it's crucial to remember that these physical ailments are not meant to cause you harm or distress. They are a form of communication, a way for your twin flame to let you know they are there with you, sharing in your experiences, your joys, your pains. It's like a silent language, a unique dialogue between two connected souls. And while it may be challenging to decipher at times, each ailment, each discomfort is a piece of a larger puzzle a part of the ongoing conversation between you and your twin flame. So the next time you experience unexplained physical discomfort, pause for a moment. Reflect on what's happening in your life, in your twin flame's life. Remember, these physical changes are not random. They are messages waiting to be understood. Have you noticed a sudden change in your eating habits? It could be your twin flame communicating with you. One of the most intriguing ways twin flames communicate through body changes is through our appetites. Yes, you heard it right. Our eating habits and food preferences can mysteriously change as a consequence of this spiritual connection. Imagine this, you're typically a meat lover, but suddenly you find yourself craving for a bowl of fresh salad. Or perhaps you've always been a fan of spicy food, but these days you're reaching for milder flavors. This sudden change in your palate could be a sign that your twin flame is influencing your preferences. This is because twin flames are two halves of the same soul, and they share a profound spiritual connection that transcends the physical realm. This connection can manifest itself in various ways, and changes in appetite is one of them. When your twin flame is going through a specific phase or feeling a certain emotion, it can influence your food preferences, for instance, if your twin flame is experiencing a period of healing or detoxification, you may find yourself drawn to healthier food options. Conversely, if they are going through a stressful time, you might have cravings for comfort food. However, it's essential to note that these changes in appetite are not always drastic. They can be as subtle as a sudden liking for a particular cuisine that you've never tried before, or an aversion to a food item that you used to enjoy. Also, remember that these changes should not cause any distress or unhealthy eating habits. The purpose of this communication is to bring about a sense of unity and understanding between twin flames, not to cause harm. So the next time you experience a sudden shift in your food preferences, take a moment to reflect. It might be your twin flame communicating with you, sharing their experiences and inviting you to join them in their journey. So. A sudden craving for a food you usually dislike may not be as random as you think. Let's take a look at the last four ways your twin flame might be communicating with you. First up, unusual physical sensations. Have you ever felt a sudden chill or perhaps a tingling sensation that you can't quite explain? It's as if an electric current is coursing through you, making your skin tingle and your hair stand on end. 
These sensations are not simply random occurrences. They could be a sign that your twin flame is trying to connect with you on a deep spiritual level. Now, let's talk about dreams. Dreams have always been seen as a gateway to the subconscious mind, a space where our deepest fears and desires can play out. But what if these dreams are not just a product of our subconscious? What if they are messages from our twin flame? Vivid, emotionally charged dreams that seem to hold a deeper meaning could be your twin flame's way of communicating with you. They might appear in your dreams, or you could dream about situations that mirror your twin flame's experiences. Next, heightened emotions. Emotions are a universal language. They allow us to connect with others on a level that words sometimes fail to reach. When you share a bond as profound as that with a twin flame, your emotions can become intertwined. You might find yourself feeling inexplicably happy, sad, or anxious, mirroring the emotional state of your twin flame. This heightened emotional awareness is another way your twin flame might be reaching out to you. Lastly, increased intuition. You know that gut feeling you sometimes get, that inexplicable sense of knowing. That's your intuition. And when it comes to twin flames, this intuition can become particularly pronounced. You might find yourself knowing things about your twin flame that you have no logical way of knowing. You might sense their presence, their emotions, or even their thoughts. This is not a coincidence. Your intuition is a powerful tool, allowing you to tune into the subtle energies of your twin flame. Each of these signals Unusual physical sensations, vivid dreams, heightened emotions, and increased intuition is a unique form of communication. They are ways in which your twin flame might be reaching out to you. But remember, these signs are subtle. They are easy to overlook, easy to dismiss as mere coincidences. But if you pay attention, if you listen closely, you might just hear the whispers of your twin flame. So. Take note of these sensations, these dreams, these emotions, and these intuitive hunches. They might be more than just random occurrences. They might be your twin flame's way of communicating with you, of reaching out to you across the physical divide. And remember, these signs are not just about communication. They are also about connection. They are a reminder of the profound bond that you share with your twin flame, a bond that transcends the physical, that bridges the spiritual. So next time you feel that unexplained chill, or have that vivid dream or experience that heightened emotion, or sense that intuitive hunch, remember, it might just be your twin flame reaching out to you. It might just be a sign of the profound spiritual connection that you share. These signs, subtle as they may be, are your twin flame's way of reaching out to you. Now let's recap the seven ways your twin flame might be communicating with you through body changes. First off, we explored the concept of a connection that's more than physical. It's a profound spiritual bond that transcends the tangible world. This connection is what facilitates communication between twin flames, even when it manifests in physical changes. Our second stop was understanding twin flames. We delved into how these are souls that have split into two, each half journeying separately and yet eternally connected. This connection is so deep that it can cause physical reactions in the body of the other half. We then ventured into the realm of sudden energy shifts. These can be felt as inexplicable bouts of exhaustion or sudden bursts of energy. It's not just fatigue or adrenaline, it's your twin flame communicating. Following that, we looked at physical ailments. Unexplained aches, pains, or illnesses could be messages from your twin flame. They're not random occurrences, but signals that your other half is going through something significant. Next, we discuss changes in appetite. A sudden craving for certain foods or a loss of appetite might not be a simple dietary whim. It could be a sign from your twin flame, a reflection of their own experiences with food at that moment. Our penultimate point was about sensations, dreams, emotions, and intuition. Twin flames often share dreams, have heightened intuition about each other, and can feel each other's emotions. These are powerful ways your twin flame might communicate with you. And finally, we explored the idea that these changes are not random. They are messages from your twin flame, a testament to the profound connection you share. They are signs asking for your attention, 
your understanding, and your response. Remember, every change is a message. So next time your body undergoes an unexplained change, it might just be your twin flame trying to communicate with you.